the January um, camp comes around, I'm always thinking, you know, it's, you know, I thought I had a pretty good year. Hopefully, I can, I'll be recognized this year. Maybe I can get called in and, and try to do, uh, you know, what I've worked my whole career for. Pretty much the whole time I was working out with Dave, and then came home for lunch, and then got a call from Ziggy, um, and was on a flight the next morning. They're trying to get me in that night, and I'm like, oh my gosh, they're gonna, I gotta go right now. <laughs> so like, I'm not even ready. And then. Uh, they called me back later and was like, we'll get you a flight tomorrow morning. I was like, at least I got the night to say my goodbyes to my wife and her family and everybody else around and, and tell everybody. So it was, it was exciting. Probably the longest preseason I've been a part of, but uh, yesterday was my first day off. So, I mean, it was nice, but I mean, that's what it's all about. You go in there and you, you battle and you see what it's like to be at the, the highest level and amongst some of the, the better players in the league. You know, we obviously did the best we could and we got, you know, playing time as well. So in saying that, uh, it was successful. And for Jeff, you know, getting his first cap, um, everybody was happy for him. Words are powerful. I'm Ziggy Schmid. Hearing the words retard and retarded makes people with intellectual disabilities and those who love them feel like less valued members of humanity. That's why we're asking you to help spread the word to end the R word. Stop by the Special Olympics booth and soccer celebration to pledge your support. It's time to respect and value people with intellectual disabilities. Please join us in eliminating this offensive language in everyday speech. Thank you.